Ray in Langley, British Columbia, writes, Greetings, Paul. I continue to follow your vids and enjoy catching up on a bunch after a week. Okay, thanks. With a quality brew. Yes, sir. I like it. Playing with a couple of medium quality bookshelf speakers, I placed them eight inches apart and played music. Upon moving my head between them, just placing my ears in line with the baffles, I experienced a wonderful soundstage popping into existence with depth, separation, and a strange immediacy. I can't recommend this as a great listening position, but what a surprising result. How did this happen? Well, congratulations, Ray. You just invented the headphones. <laughs> I love it. What, eight inches? What about like that? So that's, you know, I don't know how wide my face is. Maybe it's eight inches, a foot, or something. So, yeah, I mean, basically what Ray's describing is a near field listening experience. Placing them eight inches apart, that's pretty much going to be, you know, speaker. Uh, ear interaction level and yeah I mean some near field systems and th this <laughs> granted is extreme not something we're going to recommend but hey I got to tell you some near field experiences that I've had especially with um, Harbeths with oh well headphones geez we, I use the Audis headphones, the Audise, Audise, I can never pronounce that correctly. I have to get with the guy that owns the company and find out how do you pronounce that because I get, everybody's like, how do you do it this way? <laughs> okay. Well, and I appreciate the feedback, truly. I just, I don't know, but I love them. And talk about closing your eyes and getting a fabulous depth of field um, hearing deep into the music. Yes, you lose the visceral feel that you get here with the speakers in the room, which I, I frankly, I don't want to give up. I, I just, I'm not giving that up. That's why I stick with speakers. Headphones are great, and what an interesting combination here. <laughs> Take a pair of bookshelves, put them eight to 10 inches apart, and then stick your head right near it. You've, you've now got it's close as you're going to get with dynamic drivers to uh, headphones. The only problem that you're likely going to have with this setup, and again, I'm not recommending it, but just, just in order to babble on, as I tend to do, the tweeter-woofer relationship, if you get too close to it, you'll get lobing. So you want to be away a little bit farther so that the two can integrate, the tweeter and, and the woofer. So you don't want to get that lobing business when you get too close to it. Other than that, fabulous idea. <laughs> if you're bored on a weekend, there you go. Something for you to do. Okay. Thanks for the question. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.